I basically had to design a, a feature for Bobmin and it included all the different like landmarks in Bobmin because I wanted to incorporate everything that was Bobmin was about basically and put it in a design. Well, I'm amazed about it because it's going to be there for the rest of my life. I go to the trails quite a lot like Cardinham and Lanhydrock when I can with my brother and my dad. Yeah, I'll be doing a lot more especially now I've got a bed bike. <laughs> Well, the idea of, of, of the whole scheme is to give the centre of Bobbin a different feel so that people feel it's somewhere special and it's somewhere to take care in as well when they're driving and walking through. So we decided that we needed something to mark the entrance to the town. So this design will be on a sort of slate plaque that will be put at the three main entrances to the town to make people to begin to be aware that they're entering somewhere different, somewhere special, that everyone's worked really hard to create. And obviously having a design that's created by a young person, so that we're looking into the future, um, is, is very apt. Well, we were impressed with the number who entered and with the quality of the designs, but Hannah stood out because she seemed to have encapsulated Bodmin. Um, she picked out all the, the landmarks that both locals identify with, but also visitors can, and it was very encouraging to bring people into our town because that's what this scheme is all about. It's about growing Bodmin and, and building Bodmin. The school feels very strongly that it wants to encourage students to cycle wherever possible, whether that's to school or um, outside school as well. Uh, so we're really pleased already that lots of children get involved with Cardinham, where there are mountain bike tracks, uh, Land Hydrock as well. But this is only going to be something that helps that, so we want it to be as supportive as possible.